Now, this broke hole right here, <laughs> trying to steal from five and below. Yes, five and below, when stuff is five dollars and below. It's funny how they always got a bunch of kids, but never have any money. I tell you, boy, let's watch this, and I'll come back with the rest of that commentary to make you mad with the truth. Now, this woman is caught red-handed, <laughs> and she's still trying to force her way out the store. She's on camera, customers are watching her, and she's still trying to steal. This, this, this shows you how they don't believe in accountability. They, don't be they, they feel like they could do anything they want to do and just get away with it. They, I mean, they actually believe this stuff. That's the crazy part about it. That's the, like, it's really crazy how they really believe that I could just do whatever I want to do. <laughs> and you're going to let me do it. And she's fighting back. And all they had to do was call the police. That's all they had to do was call the popos. You know what I'm saying? That's all they had to do. Try to stop her. Call the popos. But it's just crazy how blatant she was. <laughs> and how she really did not care. Because she's used to not getting checked. Used to not being corrected. Used to not getting, not facing the consequences of their behavior. Like most black women in our community. They feel like they could do anything they want, say anything they want. And you better not do or say nothing to me. But nowadays they getting caught. They getting called out. <laughs> they getting caught on camera. Huh? And they really don't like it. I'm your boy Zilly Dan. Always got a bunch of babies. Never have any money. Always got weave, eyelashes and... You know, nails and all this other stupid stuff. Never have any money. Always got a Negro laying up in the house. Never have any money. I'm gone.